Hello friends, welcome to SourceCAD Tutorials once again. Today I will try to make something different. I will make a bicycle chain with AutoCAD. So let's begin it. First I will select a line and make a simple line of length 20 units. Then go to circle, make a circle of radius 6 units. Again make one another circle of radius 6 unit. Now I will make another circle of concentric one with the radius of 2.7 units. Repeat circle command and make a circle of radius. 2.7 units. Now go to circle and select tangent tangent radius. Select this point, this point, and make a circle with radius 12 units. Now I'll trim all the unwanted lines from here. Go to mirror and mirror this arc about the central line. Let's delete this line and trim these two curves. Our chain unit is almost ready. Now all we have to do is join it into a single unit. Now, we'll go to 3D plane and select press pull. Select this area and press pull it one unit. To make this area clearly visible, I'll select shaded view. Our chain is complete. Now we'll make other components. For that, I'll select circle and make a circle with radius 5 units again circle this time make a circle with radius 2.7 units go to press pull again and press pull this to a height of 5 units next I'll go to cylinder Make a cylinder with radius 2.7 units and a height 10 units. We have all the three components of chain ready. Now all we have to do is assemble them into a single unit. But before making that, I'll make three different layers with layer properties manager. Now this one is our primary layer and two new layers and color it just to make layers easily recognizable and assign these objects different layers Now go to copy. Before copying this, we can fillet this geometry. For that, go to fillet, select your radius, and enter a value 0.2. Select chain mode and select this edge. Then this and this. Press enter and again. I'll change current layer to zero and I'll delete these polylines.
go to fill it again radius 0.2 and chain mode and select edges to fill it if this edge is not selected from this you have to orbit it it's done again fill it edge radius 0.2 units and select edges of the cylinder and press enter twice now I will assemble them use copy select this and enter now I will move it here and here again use copy copy this chain element select this point to copy it and copy it on its top face like this again go to copy copy this but this time use this point and copy it here Again, copy this element, enter, use the lowermost point, copy this element, the lower one point, and paste it here. You repeat the similar process for this plane also. For that, I'll select both objects once and copy you have to select an appropriate point so you need to be cautious while selecting the point otherwise it won't be copied at the correct place so I'll make the selection once again copy select both these objects select a point orbit it and paste it here now it has been copied accurately as per our requirement now we will insert this unit into chain for that again use copy copy this and then use polar mode this and this now you can delete these two geometries and make a final adjustment into this you can see the height is not common from here and from here so we have to adjust it for that use move command move select this and this object press enter select a point and enter a value of 0.5 units If you want to increase this value you can do so by selecting this again and enter a value of 0.5 again now the gap seems perfect so here is a single component of chain you can use array array part array to make a complete chain unit thank you guys for being here have a nice day